king. Tell me, Venekis, have you ever gone fishing with your son? No, never. A soldier's life is all I've had the honor to know. I would have liked to have gone fishing with my son. Spartans! Every breath that you have taken has led you to this moment. Every drop of blood, sweat, and tear, all of it has led to where you stand right now. The Persians come to make slaves of us all. I have a better idea. I say we drench the gods with their blood! What say you, Spartans? For our sons! For our daughters! For Sparta! Ah! <laughs> 
Xerxes is your head! Xerxes sends his sheep to slaughter! Come, Persian! I will bring Xerxes your head, you insolent Spartan fool! Come and get it! Your bloodline ends today, Spartan! I'll get drunk on your blood as the crows feed on your eyes! You will try, and you will fail! Xerxes is the king of kings! All will bow before him after I crush you! Come, fool! Enough talk! Time to die! My son is more of a warrior than you! Once I'm done with you, king, all of Sparta's sons will be slaves for Xerxes! Sparta's sons would rather die! <laughs> that can be arranged! Not so tough without your army to protect you! Then why are you bleeding so much? We are betrayed, my king. Xerxes knows of the path behind the mountain. They are coming. <laughs> By dawn, you will be completely surrounded. We are Spartans. When are we not? Spartans. That word will mean nothing. Xerxes wipes your bloodline from the face of you. Today was a day the Persians will never forget. Tomorrow is a day the world will remember. Finally. Wow, this is big, Layla. Did you really think it's the spear? This is the one. The book was almost right on top of it. I've never been so lucky in my life. Okay, let's start her up. Are you sure we can trust this thing? I mean, the book could be- Just started, Victoria. You're the boss, boss. I'll prep it for you. Okay, so worth noting, I've made some changes since you were last in here. <laughs> There's no keeping up with the tech industry these days. I can crank up the simulation to maximum sensory synchronization if you're up for it.
let's take this one step at a time. Understood. If you're looking for something a little more intense, I can always adjust the settings for you later. This bit will let me know how much information will be fed to you during your time in the Animus. You don't need to worry about me. I've got this. A little autonomy never killed anyone. At least, I don't think so. Just let me know if you need assistance, and I can always add the helpers back in. Listen, Layla, before you go off... If this book is right, this fear, this story, it will change everything. You're putting a lot of faith in a fairly unreliable source. Historian or not, this guy wrote about magical objects and the will of the gods. He's not Homer. Irodotos was the first recorded historian, so there's a lot more truth in that text than you think. I mean, what better way is there of finding Isu artifacts than by trusting in the guy who claimed to meet an actual descendant? I know, but... I need you to trust me. You could be right. This spear, this book, it could all be crap. But something tells me it isn't, and I'm certainly not gonna let Abstergo find out first. You're right. We haven't got much to lose anyway. There's just one small problem. What is it? This manuscript is in rough condition, to say the least. The DNA found on the spear has identified two different individuals. You're gonna have to pick which strand of DNA to pursue. The choice is yours. She'll help us find what we're looking for. I have a good feeling about this. All right, boss. We're finally good to go. 431 BCE, here we come! The start of Peloponnesian War. Good luck in there. No pressure or anything, but we're all depending on you. Abstergo isn't gonna win this time. If what the book says is true and we do actually find the artifact, the assassins will finally have a chance to rise again. You can do it! Oh, and Victoria? Read the book. It holds the secrets I won't be able to find on my own when I'm in there. Aye, aye, Captain. Cyclops got a message for you. Tell your boss he can stick it. That's for last week! Malaka! The Cyclops said you like to act tough, so act tough! Get a little closer, and I will. You should know by now. The Cyclops always collects his debts. You have a lesson to learn. If the Cyclops wants to teach me, tell him to come here himself. Never mess with the Cyclops!
Nah. Thanks for the warning. Ugh. What happened to you? It's nothing, Phoebe. All taken care of now. The Cyclops again, huh? Hasn't he learned his lesson yet? Apparently not. Of course. Help yourself. You hungry too, Icarus? <laughs> Do you think Zeus would bless me with an ego like he blessed you, Cassandra? Maybe you could ask him for me. I'll try to put in a good word for you. Finally. So, what are you doing here? Oh, I almost forgot. Marcos is looking for you. What does that weasel want now? Don't know. He wants you to meet him at his new house. On his vineyard. What? A vineyard? Malaka. It's on the road to Sami. He says wine will make him rich. Well, I guess I owe Marcos a little visit. Thank you, Phoebe. <coughs> I'll go tell Marcos you're coming. Fun's over. Tell that one-eyed freak if he ever sends you here again, I'm gonna cut out his other eye and feed it to my bird. I'll see Marcos as soon as I'm dressed. I'll have to go up top to get dressed. Phoebe slept here again. Poor kid. No place to call home. Let's get this on.
for sparing you? No manners. What you've gotten yourself into this time, Marcos. You can't do that. Why? It's my farm. I can plant what I want. The grapes will die here. All of them. You have to forget what you know about the past, my friend. Together, we will revolutionize winemaking. Believe me, you will look back on this day and... Cassandra, thank the gods. Phoebe found you in time. About grapes. I can still hear you. I was worried sick. The Cyclops sent his scum to find you. I think they mean you harm. I wish you would have told me that before they hit me. But that's beside the point. You bought a vineyard, Marcos? A vineyard? Why not? I like wine, you like wine, everybody likes wine. Everybody buys wine. Why not from me? Because you don't know how to grow grapes or make wine? I'm a fast learner. You grow grapes on the vine, then you get some wine. <laughs> it's that simple, is it? You know me better than to think I don't have a plan. Marcos always has a plan. All right. Then do you have the money you owe me? Do I have the money I owe you? Uh, of course, of course. Well, no, not at the moment. Then get it. Instantly, my friend, instantly. But uh, maybe you should do that. There is a merchant in Sami. I'm not very good at these things, as you know. You want me to collect my own debt? It's just waiting for you and Sami, my friend. Who's the merchant? Luris. You know Luris. He's very nice. Luris? How stupid can you get? Stop giving him money! He always pays me back. After I threaten him. Exactly. Everybody benefits. Luris gets his money, I get my interest, and you have work. Kefalonia is wonderful, is it not? He'd better have my money, Marcos. I'd hate to have to sell our vineyard. Of course he will. Oh, after, there's another matter I want to discuss with you. After. Fine, but I'm taking a horse. It's too hot and too long a walk to go on foot. But think of it as interest, Marcos. Everybody benefits. Of course, my friend. You shall have your pick. I've made my choice. Which one will it be? I'll take the one in the middle. Ah, uh, 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 fine choice. But this particular breed has a few quirks that you might not be aware of. I wouldn't want you to take an unworthy horse. This is the one I want. Are you sure? Because... I'm sure, Marcos. Everybody benefits, especially you. You've chosen the great Phobos. He's never let me down. Phobos. Remember, meet me at the temple in Sami when you have uh, your money from Duris. Ah, Efterpi. There's plenty of wine left to buy. Don't fret. Not now, you fool. Phoebe's been taken. By who? 
Thugs of the Cyclops. Who else? Snatched her right off the main road. Tell me where they went. In the direction of Itimena Beach. The beach? Can she swim? I'll get her. Yes, go. But don't forget about dear Duris, Cassandra. Let's go. Mighty Kefalus, I entreat you, send us a champion, someone worthy of your mighty spear. Help your priestess in her hour of need. You called? <gasps> oh, Cassandra. You startled me. Why are you looking for a champion? I need someone worthy to win the Spear of Kefalus. I've been deciphering some of the sanctuary stone carvings. They say the spear was hidden in the caves beneath Kefalonia when the temple was built. You could get it for me, couldn't you? I can give you a reward. If the spear is in the caves, I'll find it. Well, maybe you were sent by Kefalus. I'll see what I can find. Oh, thank you. I'll prepare a spot in the sanctuary. Oh. <laughs> 
Ranu. Oh no. You don't look so good. I angered them, I think. The gods. <sighs> Murder or impiety? Neither. I used to worship Hermes at the Drogorati cave. There are gods there too, you know. In the cave? They grant wishes if you bring them tribute. So everyone makes an offering and asks for something in return. Ah, no wishes of mine granted though. I'm running out of money and tribute. I'm poor myself, you know. I did something wrong. You know Hermes. He can be a trickster. Oh. But there are many gods in this cave, all asking for different things. Go hear them yourself. You'll get my last tribute if you do. I need to know if they're real. All right, don't worry. I'll go. Oh, thank you. Remember, be careful where you step, Mystios. You'll be walking on holy ground. We'll see about that. The Drogorati cave. There's a draft here. A crack in the wall? Best stay out of sight. Fire! Shit! Out!
all along. People should have known something was off. And here's all their loot. All I can offer you is devotion, but I need your help. I'm poor. I have four hungry children and nothing else. I weave baskets for the market, but my cart is ruined. How can I repair it? Or sell my wares without it? Without you? I'm listening, child of Vermis. Oh, mighty God, I beg you, help me. Your prayer is heard. You will find riches at your door sooner than you expect. I knew you'd listen. My every sunrise and sunset is yours. Everything beneath my humble roof in Sami is devoted to you. Yes, now go home and wait for fate to intervene. I will, great God, I will. Well, if money is what she needs, the bandit stolen loot will do just fine. No gods in the caves. Only bandits stealing people's hopes and Rahmi. <gasps> I knew it! Thieves! At least you know you won't face Zeus's wrath. Maybe he'll take pity on you. I hope Zeus brings his wrath on those bandits. Don't worry. I brought mine. That should be good enough.
Let's go. There they are. I'll sneak up on them, I like it. Let me go! Shut it, or I'll tighten those ropes! She'll make good ransom drachmi for the Cyclops. No one's gonna buy me from you. They're all poor. Keep quiet, Phoebe. Tall grass will keep me hidden. Uh. Not let the rest of those malakas get away. Huh? I heard something. Looks like it was nothing. Uh. Marcos is going to be next. Time to get Phoebe out of here. Cassandra, I'm here. Untie me. Are you all right? It wasn't so bad. Last time they put a cloth in my mouth so I'd stop biting. Phoebe, just be careful. You're alone now since... Since my parents died? I'm okay. I've got you, and you've got me and Marcos. We're your family, right? You'll have to be stronger than that! Don't give in! Let him have it! Got you! <laughs> Again! Up! Yes, Pater. Spartan rises as soon as they have fallen. Ready or stop? Widen your stance. A soldier grounds themselves. Hmm? Good. Good. Huh. Approach me. Ah! That's enough, Nikolaus. The sun's going down. Time to eat, don't you think? <laughs> Tonight, we are having baby Alexios. <laughs> and what a feast he will be. No, not him. Take me instead. I'm tasty. Yes, yes, you're all sweet as honey. Now, come inside. The lamb's turning black. Here. Lay him in his bed. Yes, Pater. Cassandra. You. Are my greatest pride. Remember that. You will bring this family to glory. Go. Right. 
You worry too much. <laughs> you don't worry enough. We'll be all right if we watch out for each other. Which reminds me, the thug said you should watch your back. what they say? They said the Cyclops put a big bounty on you. Talos the Stonefist wants you dead. Talos the mercenary? Am I ever not in trouble? Better get him before he gets you. I hear he's really mean. I'll find my way back to town. Here! Talos the Stonefist has just what I need today. Another broken nose. I'm going to have to take care of that. Looks like these new baskets were off to market until the cart broke. Just like she said, the cart looks pretty worse for wear. Sami, Doris will be at his shop. Oh. This should help. Better them than the bandits. Got 
got a job to do, Cassandra? Get your po- Hello, Luris. Business looks good. Tell Marcos to come down here himself, if he wants his money. Huh? No, but I'm here now. Look, I was a little late paying. Now Marcos says I owe him double because of interest. I don't have it to spare. Double? That's robbery. <laughs> That's what I told Marcos. You know him, he's extreme. If you pay him, this will all be over with. You told Marcos I've paid enough already. I won't bow to, to, to a mercenary or to someone foolish enough to borrow money from the Cyclops. From the Cyclops? That's how he bought his vineyard? Look, I know you'd be dead without Marcos. What with him taking you off the street as a kid. But you know what he's doing is crazy. Right about that. Forget the Drachmi. Marcos and I need to have a talk. You're letting me go? Then at least take this sword. Nothing special, but it's better than that rusty one you've got. With the Cyclops involved, I'll need it. You better set Marcos straight or you're both dead. be spotted here.
running out of time until the Cyclops comes for you, Malaka. He wants his money. Could I have an extension? When he sails back to Kefalonia, he'll come and break you as soon as he docks, if you don't get it. Now, let's be civil. You can't hide behind your glories, Mistios forever, Marcos. He'll kill you, the mercenary, and that little runt girl that hangs around. Of course, not a problem. I'll get the drachmi. Good. Or well, I'll come and watch the Cyclops feed you to his goats. Ah, Cassandra, I can tell from the smile on your face, Duris has paid you your drachmi. Who's smiling? I just heard where you got the drachmi for the vineyard. Are you out of your fucking mind? We can get the money back, can't we? I'm sure it's possible. You've made an idiotic promise, Marcos. One we can't keep. I thought you were invincible. Maybe I am, but you're not. <sighs> I long for the old days. Remember them? They were simple. You had nothing, young and alone, and I had everything. And I gave you the world, Kefalonia, in the palm of your hand. Alexios! Don't see fishes like you every day, huh? <laughs> oh! Ha! You hungry? How about we make a deal? I do something for you. You do a few things for me. Everybody wins. Best offer you're gonna get. Huh? Think about it. Wait! <laughs> Kefalonia. <laughs> Some gift. You were nothing without Marcos. And look how far we've come. From an orphan on the streets to a Mistios with a hovel. And now the Cyclops will take everything away. I can't protect you from him forever. He'll kill me too. Oh, don't be scared of him. And look at you! How could I go up against him? With what weapons? A rusty spear? A broken bow? There you are. Skulking around the temple won't save you from me, Marcos. Drusilla! I was just talking about you. You were? I need that wood, Marcos. These new bows will be the talk of the island. I can't make anything with those bandit malakes stopping the wood shipments. Of course you can't. Why, I was just filling my friend Cassandra in on the details. She already has a plan to deal with these bandits. You know me. Always prepared. What did I tell you? She will leave no stone unturned. I don't care who does it, but someone better got those bandits. Today. A wonderful idea. I, for one, uh, need to rush home. Cassandra, I've cooked up a plan for our Cyclops dilemma. See me when you have time. If you want your wood, you'll have to fix my broken bow first. Hmm. I usually only pay when the deed is done, but shit's moving at a snail's pace. Follow me. Thank you. 
These balls will make me rich as Chrysos. They're that good, are they? Wars brewing. The Athenians need new bows if they want to hold off the Spartans. Everybody benefits, I guess. Who are you? Marcos? You'd make a fortune in this war. Plus, I hear you're a secret Spartan. That was a long time ago. I'm a Kefalonian. Hand it over. There you go, good as new. That bow is as strong as Heracles himself. Give it a try. Shoot your arrow at those dummies! Fair is fair. Are you going to get my wood? Those fucking bandits need a thrashing. Fair is fair. I'll fix your wood problem. Finally! Marcos sure is lucky he's got you as a scapegoat. I'll take care of the bandits. Make sure that you do. And be quick about it. No, your moaning won't get the job done any faster. I'll kill the bandits and get your fucking wood back. I, I I know you will. Take your time finding them. I trust you. All right. I did something for you. Now you do something for me. Get my wood. Athena, <laughs> Here's where the ambush happened. I should look around. Oh, that's a lot of footprints. A group left this area, headed west. The cart was emptied, then left behind. The thief can't have gotten far with that much cargo.
shot in the back while fleeing. Must be the work of bandits. That must be the bandit camp I'm looking for. Better take some lumber back as proof. That old bag won't just take my word for it.
Mistios, fresh vegetables for your journey. The juiciest in Kefalonia. I'm not really in the market for vegetables. No one is. Our stock is practically decomposing. We're trying to make enough rachmi to get out of Kefalonia. It's about time we moved on. I know what you mean. Wait. Creosa, you think she could help us? I think she could. You'll have to tell me what it is first. Are you scared of sharks, Mistios? I'm not scared of anything. That makes one of us. A very hungry one swims in our way of leaving Kefalonia. A shark? He guards a precious necklace. We get it, sell it, and leave Kefalonia. The old bandit who found it first buried the necklace on the shore, near a temple. And the fool didn't think. Water rises. Now the necklace may as well belong to the shark. Vegetable drachme is all right, but necklace drachme is best. I know what it's like to want to leave Kefalonia. Who wouldn't? We have nothing here. As many vegetables as we please. But no hope. It's buried in a chest. If you get it for us, we'll take what we need to get out, and you can keep the rest. All right. I'll kill your shark. You'll skewer him. You'll find him deep in the ruins of Grani down south. To the shark's temple, I go. I'll never look at another vegetable again after this.
By the gods! What's happened here? Come on! Down there. Found it. That's the necklace. That shark put up a good fight. He must have liked it. We can finally leave. No more vegetables. <sighs> we'll have a new life. One far from our past. I know what that's like. Good luck. We owe you everything.
Έλα. Ah, it's Marcus' assistant, bringing me the wood I need, I hope. Assistant? I don't think so. I... I meant Marco's muscle. How stupid of me. This will tide you over until the rest of the wood arrives in town. By the gods! You sure you work with Marcos? He's never once delivered on a promise. Incredible. I might work with him, but we're nothing alike. I'm true to my word. Then take your pay. Give none to Marcos. Come on. Sammy. I wonder if we'll be able to leave without getting into a brawl. Oh my kidding. This place never changes. <laughs> Cassandra, have you come back to talk about the spear? I have. Oh, good. Tell me, did you find it? You mentioned a reward. Oh, of course. You've certainly earned it. I should have known it was you who'd ask for the fur, Zilos. And I should have known it was you to get them for me. Cassandra's always on the job. Don't tell Marcos. He'll get jealous. I posted publicly to give the others a chance, but you're always so keen. What are the pelts for this time? The Athenians want armor for the war. Good protection for them. Good drachmi for me. Here they are. All accounted for. In record time, too. Take your pay. It's well earned. Stay out of trouble, Lilos. You should take your own advice. 